It's that time again. Shop with me today at my favorite place, the Goodwill Outlet, the Goodwill Bins. Always cool stuff in this store. Today, I'm going to just talk about some thrift store shopping, guys. But before I do, you got to see this crazy can. This can is from the year 2000. It's 24 years old, you guys. How insane. How did that even get in here? 24 years old. That tells you what kind of stockpile of stuff that we have at different places at thrift stores. Things like you just never know what you're going to find. Today I want to talk to you about three things that you should look for at a thrift store. Not just at a Goodwill bin, but any thrift store. Number one, you should definitely look for books. Because books are usually pretty cheap. At a thrift store like a Goodwill bin, here, they're a quarter each. I've been able to get some books and resell them for $15, $20. It's pretty awesome. And if you go to a thrift store, books sometimes can be bought in a huge bag for, for like four or five bucks. Fill a bag. And you just never know. You can sell them on a local auction. If you're a reader, you can stockpile your shelves for days. You keep it all out of the landfill. And that's what we're trying to do here. To save things from going to the landfill. And to bring nostalgia back to the ilfers of the world. I see you out there, guys. All right, number two. The second most thing you should definitely look for in thrift stores is just the overall wares, like the stuff you see on these tables. The reason why? Because there's lots of cool stuff you can find. Kind of like this Calvin Klein pants. You never know what you're going to find. And it doesn't have to be at a bin. It could be at a regular thrift store, your favorite little thrift store in town. Go shop there. Now, Sometimes the prices have gone up. Well, inflation comes up, it happens. And it depends on what thrift store you go to. Maybe they've got some other overhead things they got to take care of. Because, you know, they got to keep the lights on. They got to keep the water running. Got to keep the electric flowing where they can ring you up. Where you can buy all the cool treasures that we seek around the area. We are pop culture collectors. You never know what you'll find at places like this. I've found some really cool action figures. I've found, I've found toy accessories. I've found all kinds of cool, rad stuff. Video games. i found some DS games. i found action figures. I've found a goal for me to play hockey with. All kinds of stuff. You never know what you're going to find in a place like this. Ooh, a BB-8 plushie. Definitely been played with, but it's still pretty cool looking. We want to save things from the landfill. And the best way you can do that is support your local thrift store. Because they've got reasons for why they are doing what they do. They're not just there just to do it. Oh, check it out. Star Wars. You know, these thrift stores, they have a reason for being here. Besides taking care of the environment, it's also giving people opportunities to live, whether it be working or giving them a scholarship or giving people food, helping people with their rent. You know, it's taking care of people. And I Love Loose Figures wants to take care of people. That's what we're here for. We love rifling through these tables to find things, to be able to buy, to save it from the landfill, and to be able to give it a new home where somebody else can enjoy the things that they loved as a kid. Check this thing out. This thing's pretty sweet if I can freaking open the dang thing. Oh, uh, can I get it? Here. No, come on. I can't believe it. I had a lot of problem. One-handed people. Here we go. This is pretty cool sundial, man. It's going for a pretty decent amount on eBay. Pretty cool. I'll put that to the side. I might get that. But just looking through stuff, you may never, you just never know what you're going to find here, guys. You just never know. I appreciate you guys watching today. 
Like, subscribe, make the world go round. Tell me the, your favorite thing that you've seen in this video. Tell me your favorite memory of shopping at a thrift store. Let me know. I got one more thing to tell you, and here's the number one thing. Close, close, close. It's the number one most mass-produced product in the world because people have to wear clothing, and you never know what you're going to find. It could be pop culture-related, like that baseball jersey. It could be all kinds of clothes, and people buy clothes for resell or to just wear because, you know, we have to have clothing. We don't want to see everybody around naked. That'd just be horrible. Well, I appreciate you guys listening today. May the Vo be with you. We'll see you guys next time on I Love Loose Figures.